Uh, okay, hello guys, and today I hope I will make really useful video which will help you to play and enjoy. Yes, I hope you can enjoy this Japanese game. What Japanese game developers did? They released Neo Nio. I'm not sure how to pronounce correctly, game for consoles, for PS4 and for Xbox One. Then they just ported console game with console controls to PC. In my opinion, this is just very huge disrespect to PC gamers because let me show you please because there is no keyboard plus mouse controls in this game for PC version yes you heard me correct you cannot play this game on PC using mouse you can play using keyboard and here I will give you some screenshots you can check, look and understand how to play on keyboard only. And same in this video, I will show you and I will explain you how to use mouse and rebound all keys to your mouse, keyboard and play as normal PC gamers do. I, I have no idea. This is like a, this is not not amateur company, not schoolboys company. But why did they do that? I, I have no fucking idea. My brain cannot accept it. I just just check it out, guys. Yes, now I'm using a keyboard on look system controls. And you see, all this crap, I mean, all skills, all buttons are bound to gamepad only. You see, if I will try to switch uh, control configuration, all types, this is all for gamepads. Uh, I'm just shocked just no commands okay now watch carefully how you can play this game using keyboard mouse and rebound all keys all buttons as you like first of all you will have to download this gamepad emulator gpd SCK 3.2.1 I will give you link so you will be able to download this emulator what are we doing now we have to launch this emulator and bound all keys as we like but remember one thing guys that it's wrong mapping of the keys just completely wrong so you have to experiment and uh, put all these keyboard and mouse buttons as you like as you want as you feel comfortable to play I will show you some settings like video settings this screen please remember all these settings just copy paste and do exactly the same how can you test click test video device properties and please I beg you 
Do not forget to press F4. It will run the script. As you see in this window below, press this key to run the script. Without pressing F4 or any key you would like to bound, it will not work. So just press F4. You will see this amazing word this emulator is on. And you see, I'm moving my mouse and Z axis and Z rotations work. Press F4 one more time to stop the script. OK. Now let's try to play. OK. We started the game. Let's click continue. My god, guys, I'm very sorry for this loading screen and a long loading time. It's Unexpect unexpected fail. Okay, so game started, and you can see we have mouse cursor. So all we have to do is press F4 to run the script. You will hear this sound, and you see, I can use my mouse. This is left button. This is right button. One, two, three, four keys are this min menu to the left. So I can use all my healing potions, shuriken, stones, just pressing one, two, three, four buttons. And that's it. I put like a evade on Z. I can do all the tricks. I put target lock on my middle mouse button so you see guys you can play as normal PC gamers playing all normal PC games I really hope this video was useful because it was real pain for me to understand how to use and how to run the script to rebound all keys to tune all this crap as I like, as I feel comfortable to play, but it, <laughs> it was worth it. Thank you very much for watching, thumbs up if you like this video, write comments down below if you would like to see walkthrough, maybe some game tips, maybe some other amazing information about armor, about gameplay, about weapons, about combos, about forging skills and blah blah blah. Good luck.